hello guys welcome to knowledge bond youtube channel in this video i would like to uh, demonstrate how to write a program to sort uh, numbers from array the numbers uh, may be either positive or negative so let me start with uh, by taking one simple uh, integer array so i'll give the name on unordered numbers so let me take like um, so so 30 and uh, 10 minus 90 minus 40 and 50 uh, 25 70 uh, some numbers 54 and uh, minus uh 80 so let me take another final number um we'll take it uh, 38 hmm? so let me take one simple uh, loop to for int uh, i equal to uh, from 0 to uh, till uh, to numbers dot length then I press plus so this sorter for loop is responsible for looping all numbers uh, from the list list or array okay so it starts from 32 till 38 this for loop is only responsible for looping all so i'll take it another uh, inner for loop in i'll take it another number let me start with um, the next number. So J is less than is equal to same length J plus plus. So so this inner for loop is. Uh, For uh, find the lowest number and then swap swap the array to place that lowest number uh, in the beginning. So then let me take one simple condition check for lowest number and then if it throws then it we need to swap that number if order numbers of um, in case if it is uh, greater than so then we need to swap it so let me take one simple temporary variable int uh, temp is equal to we'll initialize with zero. So so this is simple uh, swap logic logic over here like uh, temporary variable. So not a number of um, if it finds any number then uh, we'll take it that j number into time and uh, of so that number again in that place we'll keep it that uh, the previous number so 
so then we'll move to that uh, number to first place the selected location number of five going to same that number temp number whichever we kept in that earlier okay so the logic is very simple let me print that number um, console dot right line order numbers of the lowest number so before running let me keep the control console dot right line okay so let me give one simple message to user console dot right line sorted numbers are okay so let me put a debug pointer over here and um, we'll run this program So I started um, uh, the number from 30 in the first loop. Then second loop is responsible for uh, checking all the numbers after 30, the 10, 90, minus 90, minus 40, 50, 25, till end of the 38. Checks if it like uh, less than any of 30, then it moves that number to 30 place. So before that, uh, we'll see the array is 30, 10, minus 90, the original array is, is very similar. Then after finding the lowest number, um, we'll go through again. So check for uh, from one, J of one is minus, is nothing but 10. And uh, checking this uh, first number, 30 with 10. If it is 30 is greater than 10, then uh, it moves that number, it swaps that number. So it started and uh, keeping that so 10 and as a temporary the second place 30 cj of uh, 1 is 30 see that number is place 30 and the 10 is in uh, temporary variable right now so after the swap we'll see so 10 uh, placed into very first since uh, 10 and 30 is compared and out of uh, comparison it finds 10 is the lowest number then it swap those two number then it do similar thing for the remaining numbers um, this time i is same number and 30 is checking for minus 90 So let me see this array. So now the minus 90 uh, placed in uh, first place. So it does for a similar checks for taking the 30 and comparing 10 and it's swapped. Then taking the 30 and comparing with 90. And obviously if my 30 and minus 90 compare those two. So whichever is lowest it placed to first place. Then the second loop, third loops, uh, so minus 90, 30. Uh, this time 30 is checking with 40. Like that, after uh, first iteration of first number, and uh, the second for loop is completed, uh, then we'll see the results. And minus 90, uh, 30, 10, minus 40, 50, 25, 70, minus 54, minus 80, and uh, 38, okay? So it checks these two numbers and uh, minus 90 is the lowest number out of uh, remaining array. So then it plays the minus 90 into very first place. And let me so do for second loop completely. So 
after completion of second iteration, second number comparison. So we'll see this time. So minus 90 and minus 80. Uh, after minus 90, the minus 80 is next lowest number. Then it moved to the second place. So like that, it does for remaining things. The logic is very simple. Uh, going through the second loop and if finds any lowest number, then it starts swap. So after third iteration, we'll see minus 90, minus 80, minus 54. And definitely this time minus 40, minus 40 would be the lowest number uh, out of the remaining uh, remain numbers. Then minus 40 would be placed um, at um, uh, array of three. That means after minus 54. So let us go through that part, how it is done. Yes, we'll see this time. So minus 90, minus 80, minus 54, minus 40. And we have um, 50, 30, 70, 25, 10, 38. And um, the next iteration, uh, it would definitely find 10 is the lowest number. Then the 10 would be placed um, after uh, minus 40. So let us go through. If you imagine this logic, um, then the writing code is very easy. So this time we'll see. Yeah, 10 is the uh, place after minus 40. So we have another 50, 70, 30, 25, and 38. Uh, out of uh, these numbers, 25 would be a next lowest number. Uh, that would be placed after uh, 10. We'll see. Yes. Yes, minus 90, 80, 54, minus 10, 10, 25. So we have another uh, four numbers, 70, 50, 30, and 38. Uh, 30 would be another lowest number out of uh, remaining four numbers. This would be placed after 25. So yes. So this time we'll go through the loop again. So minus 90, minus 80, minus 54, minus 40, 10, 25, 30. So we have another three numbers, 70, 50, and 38. So 38 would be the lowest number out of three. Uh, this would be placed after 30 uh, in the next loop. So we'll go through. Yes. So let us see the Oh, yes, after 25, 30, and 38, we have another two numbers, 50 and 70, it is already been sorted. So this time would we'll display the results. It will come out, um, yes. We'll see, the sorted numbers are minus 90, minus 80, minus 54, minus 40, 10, 25, 30, 38, 50, and 70. So, logic is very simple so here the uh, i took one um, array uh, where uh, we can take it these numbers either from user or uh, we can hard code these numbers uh, then i took one temporary variable and two for loops one swap logic that's where very simple the logic is very simple if you visualize this output um, uh, then writing programming is very easy uh, i hope um, so I clearly explained the logic. 
thank you very much for your time if you like this video and please subscribe to my youtube channel uh, then you would get the latest updates from this channel uh, thanks thanks again for your